lot going on in Memphis. There's a whole lot going on in Memphis. There's some good things going on. I hope everybody had a good 4th of July. Uh, everybody getting ready for the kids to go back to school. We've been enjoying the summer. Like I said, hit the like button, hit the share button. Uh, let us know your city and state as you're coming in. We would really appreciate that. It helps the channel grow. So if there's a lot of things going on in Memphis. I just personally, I just got back from Denver, Colorado. Uh, two weeks ago, y'all already know I was in Dallas handling business at a graduation. So then one of my partners recently lost his father. So I just got back from Denver yesterday. So check it. It was a shooting last night in the Orange Mound area. It was a shooting last night in the Orange Mound. Uh, it, it was so sad, man. Like the, the shooting that happened yesterday in Orange Mound, it was just so sad. It was just so, so sad. Uh, apparently, it was a woman gunned down, a church's chicken employee gunned down yesterday. A church's chicken employee, a woman was gunned down yesterday. It was a sad day in Memphis yesterday. And uh, rest in peace, the church's chicken employee, the woman lost her life. Supposedly over a two-piece. Supposedly a woman lost her life over a two-piece of chicken in Orange Mound yesterday. Like, this is, this is horrible. Like, Everybody's walking around mad. They ready to grab their gun. Man, ain't no way in <clears throat> hell I would want to be in jail about no fucking two pieces from church's chicken. Like, I don't give a damn what happened. There's no reason, no excuse to take nobody's life or even to be arguing with nobody about no two pieces of fucking chicken from churches. So, what is happening was in Orange Mound on Park Street. Supposedly, the woman who the police looking for is a woman with purple hair. They didn't show a picture of the uh, Church of Chicken employee later who lost her life yesterday. All that they said was it was an argument that ensued. It was a it was a horrible argument that ensued in uh in the drive-through line at churches. And it led to somebody losing their life. Uh, that's why everybody don't need no gun. Everybody doesn't. Everybody don't need firearms, man. Everybody don't need no gun out here. Like some people, they just don't need a gun. Some men don't need no gun. Yeah, lucky duck. Like, man, that was horrible. Man, like, took their life, man, over. Over that, you know what I'm saying? Over a two piece from churches, man. Come on, man. Like then you a female, you could have been at home cooking anyway. Like you done threw your life away over a two piece from churches. Like churches, Popeyes, KFC, my they ain't never been that good. You know what I'm saying? Like none of them have ever been that good. Well, I'm gonna throw my life away over no fucking two piece. So. I just want to say condolences to the woman who lost her life. I want to start out saying condolences to the woman who lost her life at uh, the churches yesterday in Orange Mound on Paul Street. I ain't been to their churches in a long time. You know what I'm saying? I got family that stay over there in the mound. But I personally ain't been over there in a minute. But I want to say rest in peace to that lady. And I just want to send condolences to the kids and everybody over there like, you know, Memphis, man, let's do better. Like, I pray we do better. Like, debt can't be it. You know what I'm saying? Debt there can't be it. We can't just start want to take nobody's life who are already working a low-paying job in churches. You know what I'm saying? They trying to feed their family and take care of their own personal bills. And just for somebody to lose their life at work, I don't even care who it wrong. I don't, I don't care what the argument was about. It should have never went that far. You know, uh, but as people see with the people in Memphis, they do crying and then they get back out. You know what I'm saying? So the streets and, and, and everybody think they can do it now. Like, man, I can go, I can bust this fag. I'm going to be right back out on the town, back thugging. See, it's, it's a mindset. You know, 